funny. I'm not joking right now. You came out to eat and you ate twenty dollars worth of food. Okay. Am I right or am I wrong? Okay. Well, you want did me to you, order did you or did you I not even eat? order dessert? You, you ordered the bowl order and you ordered the hash browns. And that's yes. eighteen seventy five. Look it. A bowl. Eighteen seventy five with taxes. It was three eighty six, so I'm just breaking it down, split that up, three eighty six, half of that is almost two dollars. I'm thinking like one eighty or something like that. So you're oh, you owe twenty dollars. It doesn't even matter what I order or why I didn't order. What I'm saying, why would I have to pay even half of it when you're here? That's what you're here for. I'm here. I asked you, did you want to go out to eat with me? I didn't yeah. say I was going to pay. Oh, okay. Is that so common sense? Do you just go and sit down at restaurants okay, so and just figure that they're going to pay you for you? You just want to be put in the friend zone, right? Not even that. If I, you know what? Here. Whatever. I don't care. What are you acting all? Why are you acting all weird like that? I'm not acting weird. Just spank. No, you got a little spank attitude. Yes, of course I'm going to have an attitude. See, see, I'm going to tell you where I was a gentleman at. Because all them little bites that gentleman, you ate off my French right. toast. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. Hear me yeah, out. No. All them little bites, them, them bites you got off my plate. You know what I'm saying? That was uh, It cut off where he was basically just telling her all them little bites you ate off of my plate. You should be playing for my food, too. But I'm not even tripping off that. I'm going to let you slide on that. It's funny how uh when he didn't want to pay she said oh so you just want to be put in the friend zone the guy is probably already in the friend zone and he's not down to be used and he probably got some kind of inclination from her some type of attitude that she was just trying to use him and play games because we don't know what happened you know before that but you know ladies you're not entitled to a man's money it doesn't matter if it's one cent or a hundred dollars it doesn't matter stop expecting men to pay for you just to get to know you because if a man has to pay you for your time what does that make you think about it you're putting all your worth on dollars what does that what does that say about who you are as a person i don't understand why you think it's just open season for men to just spend their money on you i mean the guy is there time is money he's spending time with you that's money that's the most valuable asset anyone has is time so he's there and and to her defense i will say this to guys you know make sure that your wording is correct because we all know women like to read between lines and add different um definitions to what you say so if you don't clearly say we're going to go out to eat and we're going to pay. I'm going to pay for me and then you're going to pay for yourself. Or we're going to do Dutch. We're just friends or whatever, whatever the case may be. Because if you just say, do you want to go out to eat with me? They're going to automatically assume that, yeah, you're going to pay. And that's that little rule that they try to live by. If a guy asks you to go out, a guy asks you to do anything, he must pay. As if this is like 1950. Right? But they don't want to go back and live like it's 1950. They just want to take things and apply it you know like pulling out the chairs opening up the doors paying for dinners paying for this paying for that that is old traditional stuff and it's interesting how these ladies like to try to reach back into the past and pick and choose you know what they want to apply to today and say well you know you're a man you're supposed to do that no it doesn't work like that if you want a man to be traditional then be a traditional woman because traditional women didn't go out and just expect men to pay for anything men just did it because that is what it was and women actually reciprocated that respected that and admired that about a man they thought it was chivalrous but you ladies you don't find anything chivalrous all you're looking at is to use men men are just tired of it you think You'll say something like, oh, it was just $20. It was just a dollar. It doesn't matter how much it is. It's the principle of the thing. And the fact is, is that money does not belong to you. Let's not pretend like you're going to take yourself out on a date with the guy and pay. You're not doing anything for the guy. So you just expect the guy just to give, give, give. He probably drove you there. That's money and gas give 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 and you give nothing in return and then what you're gonna do go home next two hours go out with another guy or go out with another guy that's sitting the next day and do the same thing you're gonna put this guy in the friend zone anyway because if he would have paid and bowed down to what you wanted you would have labeled him as weak and he didn't have no game and he would have been put in the friend zone anyway and you would have just been sitting back waiting for him to contact you again saying oh can we go out again i really enjoy myself stop playing keep it 100 and if you want respect from men respect men's time and respect men's money because if you're doing this in the beginning what's going to happen if you're in a relationship with this guy men are not as stupid as you think they are 
That's my opinion on this video. You guys let me know what you think in the comments. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you're on TikTok, give me a follow and show me some love over there. I really appreciate it. And with that said, have a great day. Peace. May the force be with you.